Another thing that really irritated me that was supposed to be scary about this movie is the tremendous amount of jump scares. Oh. So every half a minute, there would just be a ridiculously loud noise that was supposed to scare you, but there was never anything scary about the noises. No. Nothing at all. Joseph Gordon-Levitt is actually responsible for the first one. He bumps into the nurse wearing a Friday the 13th hockey mask. <laughs> Yeah, so another reference. (laughs) The blame for the first pointless jump scare is firmly in your lap, Mr. (laughs) Gordon-Levitt. Oh, shit. No shit. Uh, Yeah, and and I didn't count all the jump scares, but it must have been at least over 20. (laughs) Yeah. Uh, It was a ridiculous amount. And some of them were so stupid, like just kids running past, and they just turned the volume right up to 11. No! Like, yeah. it's just kids. And then another time where some other teenagers bump into a window. <laughs> There's a scene where Laurie just bumps into Norma, the Norma character, and then just loud sound. It just got irritating. Yeah. <laughs> and each jump scare wasn't scary. I know I we've complained about modern movies using jump scares mm. to excess, but this was ridiculous and there was no build up at all. There wasn't even the obvious take all the sounds away jump scare. No. It was just loud sound in the middle of a conversation. Yeah. Or she would cross the street, loud sound. Or <laughs> she would pick up a wine glass, loud sound. It just <laughs> really got irritating. <laughs> yeah. No, you're right, actually. It's a good point because, I mean, yeah, we do talk about quite, quite bang movies, which is the thing that we joked about with Mark Kermode with The Nun, quite, quite numb. Yes. It is an irritating trend. And as Kermode says, it's a genre of horror filmmaking for people who hate horror movies uh-huh. who just want to go and be cattle prodded occasionally but even in those there's you know there's the art of misdirection and dropping the soundtrack down and surprising you in this movie Josh Hartnett will just suddenly leap into frame and say hello to <laughs> LL Cool J and you'll get a stinger <laughs> And it's pointless. I know. Entirely I know. Point, pointless and really irritating. Yes, I agree. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Um, I, I wish I'd counted it. I wish. I wish I'd uh, um, had a tally of how many jump scares there were because it, it just got out of hand. Really out of hand. Yeah. I just couldn't believe it, especially the one with um, with Joseph Gordon Levitt. Because that was actually kind of a tense moment where he's in in the house investigating, and then mm. it's just like an ironing board falls. Like, <laughs> come on, <laughs> what? 